Ruth Faison Shaw was an American artist and educator who is credited with introducing finger painting in the United States as an art education medium. She was born in Kennonsville, North Carolina in 1889. She did not receive formal training as a teacher, but began her career teaching in rural Appalachia. She spent several years in France during World War I with the YMCA as a canteen worker and spent her spare time drawing and painting. Shaw moved to Constantinople for two years to research traditional patterns and colors of Asian rug making while teaching history on location to young sailors. She decided to remain in Europe and opened an American school for English-speaking children ages 5 through 12 in Rome. Shaw thought education should be fun and that children learn best by sensory experiences. She believed that natural expression was more important than mastery of letters and spelling and had her students dictate creative stories to either herself, older students, or into a dictaphone. Shaw wanted to find a means to encourage visual expression that would parallel the use of dictation and found pencils and paint to be the tools of masters and of little use to children. In 1929, Shaw began experimenting with finger painting because she found one of her students smearing iodine on the bathroom door after having a cut on his hand. She created a paint that would combine pigment and binder in a non-toxic, water-based, gelatinous form that would be spread smoothly but not dry too quickly. Her students in Rome coined the term finger paint. Shaw took a position with the Dalton School in New York in 1932 and finger painting made its debut in the United States. Public interest grew for this medium in January 1933 when the Dalton School held an exhibition for its students, and it received national attention when Shaw published her book Finger Painting in 1934. By the mid-1930s, Binney and Smith were distributing finger paints nationally, and Shaw began to travel around the country conducting demonstrations based on her methods. Art therapy seeds were planted when Freudian psychoanalytic theories met with a progressive philosophy. Finger painting proved a very effective aid to schools and psychologists for therapeutic use with children. And the medium was used by psychologists as a projective technique for personality diagnosis and therapy and was often described in mystical terms of free self-expression and emotional release. Shaw used this medium as a tool for self-exploration with psychiatric patients at the Menninger Clinic in Kansas. And during the 1950s, she relocated back to Chapel Hill, North Carolina, where she continued working with children and mental patients at UNC's Department of Psychiatry. She died in 1969, leaving behind a legacy.